Here we are. Three of us G's. Place some shit on the hot. Look at this dirty fucking butt nugget. Gotta take the alternator out. To do that, you gotta take the manifold off and the power steering pump out. And just take the battery. Once you get this junk ass power steering out the way, you can see the alternator. And you gotta loosen this little. That guy, a little wing nut. You loosen him until he's pretty loose. And then you grab a 14 millimeter and you use a bolt down here that you gotta touch with it. All right, so it's actually a 12 millimeter. I lied to you, but I can't really see it. Get a good angle at it. I, le I left the wheel on because I'm lazy, but poop, get shit in your face. This is the bottom of this bolt right here. It's the bottom of the alternator bracket. And it goes to, you can see how it slides to adjust belt tension. And that wing nut is what you use to adjust the belt tension. So once you loosen the wing nut, you can come down here and take this, loosen this 12 millimeter bolt. And the whole alternator should start to come free. now if you can tell and we'll just continue taking that bolt out and go to the top to so remove the bottom bolt this is a 14 and you can remove this bolt it, it just slides out and it'll hit this nut i think you have to actually have to remove this nut to get it out enough and then the alternator should be free enough for you to just kind of work it start working its way out Then you go to the parts store and you yell at them to give you a brand new alternator for free, and they do. So you install it. Gotta tighten this bolt and just pull back up. Same process as uninstalling it. You got the alternator on. You just reinstall the power steering pump and call it good. Take it for a test drive. I forgot to get a recording after, so this is the next day, but you know what I mean.